That's actually crazy. Maybe it was a little cold in this uh, New York summer. Oh, no, I hate that. <laughs> Imagine wanting to, like, die because, like, you have a sweater on in freaking New York. But, you know, speaking of dying, it's what Terry does. And speaking of Terry, Vivi actually has a Terry. So I would be surprised if, like, Vivi just, like, doesn't mess up Destiny. Like, honestly, like, we're already at 87%. And look at this advantage that's being held by Vivi because it's, like, what do you do? Nothing. You get stuck in advantage and you have go and then you die like that. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Only with 23% on. No, I hate that for you. I feel like this is definitely where, you know, we're going to see Destiny have a little bit of a hard time, especially since we're at the beginning of the game. Kind of just try and, like, figure out what, like, they want to or what he wants to do when it comes to, like, playing BB. Because let me tell you about BB and their, you know, their hero. Because it be moving. It has all the power-ups when you get the power-ups. And then, you know, you just be go the whoosh and the swoosh and then the everything. And we hate that. But we don't hate that for them. Because, yeah, hero. <laughs> um, but for sure, looking at 100%, is this power dunk going to kill? Absolutely not. At 130% with Zoom and getting back to Sage relatively for free. But you're in disadvantage and then you die to... Wait, that's the power dunk, the power kick, the power punch. I um, power, power dunk. Power, power dunk. dunk. Wait, no, power dunk is where they go up and then down. Oh, did you see power? I'm not actually watching. I'm, I'm doing uh, stream things. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, but yeah, no, so we're relatively even, although BB definitely has a really good semblance of advantage. And it's kind of just like here existing because it's just like, what do they have to do? They have to do nothing but like press the buttons and then make sure that, you know, Destiny can't really do anything, which they're doing a pretty good job at. And they, they had no... They had no MP. Oh no, they SD'd All right, because yeah. of no MP. That's so, so sad. Yeah, Destiny taking the stock lead. Uh, kind of scary situation uh, for Vivi because like, how do you, when you need to like go in on Terry, that like that's what he that's what he wants. You know, the character has a lot of uh, like, well not a lot, but like can like swing in the up close, uh -huh. and an auto turnaround can make things like pretty spooky. But. Uh, Vivi, who does play the character, might have some special insight on how to especially edgeguard the character. Is what I would uh -huh. say. Destiny making onto the stage and landing the Buster Wolf, uh, getting some heavy damage on Vivi. Also, we're at like a pretty low-ish percent, or not lowish percent, but lowish Ooh. MP for Vivi. So they definitely ah. need to be able to take this stock without like losing a lot of their, you know, resources to get back to stage. Which they actually do. This whole time I spent talking about that, the stock is already taken and VV's at 96% and they really have to worry about how they're going to actually close out this game because they don't want to lose their stock very early because of like Terry things. Terry does very scary things. Terry and is yeah. Ter Terry does very scary things. All right, so yeah, Destiny going to be taking game one over VV, banning. Town and City and Kalos. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. Look at some of these replays. Yeah, 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 yeah. And I think um, this is actually where Vivi kind of, like, fumbled the back a little bit because they um, uh. were kind of locked into, you know, the, In the menu. Yeah, and then there was just, like, what do I do now? And then I think this one was really good where um, BB just kind of hit them with the shaboom and then it killed. <laughs> I don't actually know the name of that. I think that's like Sizzle, but it's whatever. Um, but anyways, going back to the second game, that's um, pretty good first stock, especially considering how BB did kind of SD. And we're looking at a pretty, you know, good game to kind of start off with, especially since, you know, Destiny kind of held that pretty well. And woo, you saw that? Oh my god, probably you didn't, Devin, but I did, and that was a really <laughs> nice movement on BB's end. And that was really that was a really nice kind of mix-up, and they kind of just, you know, kind of threw it out there just to kind of make Destiny scared. Learning those options are definitely really important in a situation where you definitely want to learn a lot about how neutral works, especially against Terry. And this is like maybe a hot take. I don't know how hot of a take this is. Oh, it could us. be Oh, absolutely. I think the shadows lose to neutral. <laughs> And, like, this is their main thing, which is neutral, but, like... Well, luckily, Terry's not a Shoto. Is... What's the difference? It, it doesn't study the Shotokan. Oh. <laughs> um, I'm still gonna call him a Shoto anyways. Y'all can uh, get mad at me. <laughs> fighting game character. FGC. Okay, I'll call there him FGC go. just for you. Just for yes, you, Devin. Yes, thank you. Yeah! Okay, let me stop. Anyways, right. so, yeah, when it comes to, like, FGC characters, they definitely kind of lose to neutral because... 
it's just like you have so much to contend with in a game full of like people who just do crazy things. So imagine having to play like neutral against Steve. <laughs> I should not be bringing this up after SmashCon, but who cares? So, yeah, uh, Destiny kind of hanging on to center, uh, being like, come come here, I have unlimited supers. Would you like to die? Yep, here we go. Uh -huh, just like Doing that. exactly that. Uh, I, I willed it into uh, existence. Ex existence, exactly. Uh, this is a scary situation. Whenever you're down to stock uh, and, like, Terry has go, it's like, oh, boy, the character with unlimited supers. You know? Uh, so what is BB going to have to do to try and get in, get, like, those small hits to kind of just, like, you know, just kind of edge uh, Terry to the, like, off stage? Honestly, like the kind of thing is that, like, this is a character that kind of relies on already having the lead. Yeah. Because you don't want to be able to have to contend in neutral with Terry when a lot of your tools just will barely not kill. And also, when you want to, like, kind of just do things, you have very slow tools at that. So it's like, how are you going to take back the lead when all of your tools are either, like, that hard, that much harder to get, or it's just like, you can, like, it's kind of just, like, percent-based. Yeah. So it's like, what can you really do about that? Well, also we got the, yeah. the level two uh, zap, or I don't know what it's called. Model, model tell me. But, you know, going to mm -hmm. finally take off that, fin uh, that first stock. Now, you know, Vivi's got some work to do, but one of the nice things it is is that, like, once you take away Terry's... Uh, Stock go. from high percent. Go is gone, and so uh -huh. like you're not as scared. He's you know still a scary character to to, to box oh with, uh, but you know, you know we we've seen like you know VV has a Terry of their own, and so like we're they're gonna have like some insight on like you know how to kind of like keep him stuffed away, mm -hmm. you know. And we're seeing a little bit of that. You know, VV beginning to turn it around. Oh wow! But, what the heck it just happened there? That was literally like. Up smash into like down smash, not breaking. Everyone for some just reason. hitting the, the strong buttons. Ooh, so the the lead that Destiny might have had, uh, gone in a flash. Boom. I love that. Yeah, Zapple. There we go. Yeah, the level two. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. And looking at this, it's definitely kind of like a little bit of a very even game. But honestly, I feel like this is definitely not something that BB wants to kind of try because it's just like. I don't think that they want to be scared half the time, just like trying to contend with, you know, a lot of what, you know, Terry has to kind of offer. It's like you have to worry about so many things, and then, like, you just die because you're very slow sometimes, unless uh, you have Accelerado. Uh, this might be... Ooh, is that going to kill? No, no, absolutely not yet. Still living with 117% and definitely trying to hang on to their stock as best as they can. But they definitely need to be able to apply safer pressure because it's looking like they are scared. They are very scared. They're scared and they don't know what to do. They only have 3 MP. What will they do? They will take center stage, but they still have to fight, especially with Accelerado on the board. And they definitely have to kind of take control of this neutral. Oh and my god. Wow. Imagine losing, you know advantage because you just traded with a B. I love that for BB's you. BB's winner's bracket is on the line here uh, in this stock. Never, and, no, it's not. And then finds it. So now we're going to game three. Absolutely. That was really down to the wire. That was super spooky. BB's bands are going to be uh, FD and Town. Absolutely. And I feel like what this does is kind of opens up a lot of, you know, advantages because it's kind of like, you know, a lot of the time, Vivi's told me that, especially with their Lucario, they definitely don't want to go to, like, Kalos. But when it comes to, like, a character like Terry, they definitely want to probably prioritize a lot of situations where they can live at very early percents and still have the ability to kill at very high percent or very low percents, more so, because it's, you know... Hero. Hero is a party game character that is based on RNG. Don't you love that? I love that. <laughs> Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. All mm -hmm. right, game three, uh, going right back to uh, Smattlefield. 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 Uh, so, all right, Destiny getting a little... Okay, I didn't really, and yeah. Okay, never mind. Uh, found some damage, and then V was just like, okay, the rest of the damage is mine. Oh, wow. You're not telling me you just really low-profiled that, and you were still able... Wow. <coughs> BB, what's going on here? Look at them. Look at them. They were just moving, and then oh. they killed. Oh no, what the heck happened that it didn't stay sleeping? Uh, whenever you get hit by uh, the sleep, if you get hit by it in the air, uh -huh. you, it's it's severely less time. So oh, that's no. why Vivi, like, Vivi saw that uh, 
landed uh, on the snooze on him when he was in the air and was just like, I need to swing immediately. Oh. No more time to charge and <laughs> nothing. A B, and that's definitely going to be death, killing at 157%. And this is definitely where Destiny starts to kind of make a little bit of their, you know, kind of goal right now because they definitely don't want to be, you know, back in disadvantage. They definitely don't want to lose their stock just to kind of some random, you know, hero shenanigans. And they can definitely do that, continue this lead, and maybe even not die to that back air like we're seeing right there. Oh. But that fair is definitely going to trade right now, killing and making the talks extremely even with Destiny trying to retaliate, but this is definitely very on the line because this is very back and forth. And if something like that happens, like a kaboom, making it so that BB will kill, I don't know. This is definitely very scary. Don't you think this is a little bit scary, Devin? Oh, uh, I'm always spooked when Terry's on the screen. The FGC go burr. Yeah. Oh no. Very nice get um, you know, controlling that get up right there, and definitely gonna try and hold a little bit of center stage and this is definitely what they need to do because they definitely want to make sure that they hold advantage as best as they can have a hold on this lead because it's definitely looking like they have a hold on this lead with that um, burn knuckle taking off that second stock and what this means is that vivi is at a very high chance for losing this game right now so if vivi doesn't pick it up they are definitely going to see their winner's bracket end pretty yeah. quickly it, it's kind of it's definitely looking like this is going to be uh destiny's game to lose so vv has to take it uh like from 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 him uh you know uh, all right so we got go online and what can vv do to, to maintain this uh edge guard Kill. Uh, uh, a uh <laughs> an accelerado forward air yep uh, gonna seal that one out and now kind of you know uh you know VB's at like a mid-ish percent. Uh, definitely gonna need a little bit more before uh, Destiny can start looking for the kill, and that's gonna be where VB's gonna try and find their turn to, you know, just get some extra uh, some, some hits in and in uh, and close the gap. Maybe turning it around, and we might be seeing exactly that. No, Destiny fighting back, maintaining like a slight percent lead. Both percents going up. Destiny widening the gap though. Honestly, I really like how BB is kind of going about a lot of all of these situations where they definitely have to space on shield and have a lot of mix-ups because they've definitely been showing a lot of mix-ups that's kind of been getting a Destiny a lot and they definitely need to continue doing that so they don't lose this game right here. Uh, that, uh, no, nope, yeah, not. I didn't think so. Mm -hmm. That was from like mid-stage, so it's definitely going to kill yet. And Zoom getting BB relatively safe I, back onto their art to the stream right I was now. kind of expecting, yeah, like the punch into Rising Tackle. That's definitely going to be it, yep. And so... Yeah, Destiny making it, uh, taking it over Dill and then Vivi. Ooh. Uh, what is it? Making it now to winner's semis. Oh my. Crazy. It's giving. Uh, let's look at some of these uh, replays. Let's oh see no. how this, uh, this last game went. You know, both of them on the second stock. Mm -hmm. And then, boom. Yeah, Burn normal knuckle. get up into Burning Knuckle. What are you doing? Get out of here. Die. Uh, That's what you're doing. Die. What did Vivi do to, uh, right, here comes like the, the accelerado jump. I wish. No swinging over there. Also, there was a lot of, there was one thing that Vivi definitely did. It was like, um, like a jab into like jump, um, back fair, which was surprisingly really good because it was really fast. And now it's just like, this is a mix up. You can't tell me this is not a mix up. This mix up is really fast. Just like how fast I'm speaking. I really hate this for me. Oh, also, well, stop. Oh, You're oh good. you know, that's very true, but why would I stop? I